me your thinking tats me masticating ke asniga the other day so woman sit on my veranda reasoning me get trigger me hear one of the ladies say me don't like dark skin black man some agree some disagree my friend then start one piece of arguing they they hallucinating each person's point of view me listening but wait when discussing the pros and cons of being with a dark skin man they forget say half a wish don't they with dark dusky midnight looking skin me na lie my mind start working them debating me reminiscing when me was young was i experiencing what to dear young people call colorism <laughs> memories journeying think back but when me graduating out of all the offers me end up choosing him the one who was not really my type walk like in reaching for the sky one boss a kingston gwan like but no hand no money boy me say cho met me anna him went to the bar we had him me couldn't help noting how the junk we was behaving cause my sisters were under talking myself be no asking was my skin too black for the idiot in him was it that he never like the color of my melanin <laughs> that summer evening the bar me and say no neither was him the two of them did well boring fed up he make up my mind deciding best be ditching the fool hardiness me side up in him get up say not a word when me and my passy from there we leave him the crew be it as muddy me near na ever be calling quick stepping me and my friends reach the local beach sit on under full moon the whole away reflecting the shoreline the caribbean sea a deep deep blue foaming and frothing we just watching waves crashing them ooming and ebbing all the way to jamaica shores as sisters suggested we stop chatting time to get going leave the beach go to tropics at ligani to shalama songs we could be cowboy dancing with not a care in there we stayed till early morning when we reach back on my mother yard pen and paper me gets to fetching eloquent structured paragraphed cursive was my handwriting a letter to him me take time scribing brethren if truth be told rat 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 articulate like bullets shot from a soldier's gun me did a sharp shooting word pictures me use describing what that night me was noticing things me was observing in all my 17 years never before me ever see such bad behaving before that letter the brother never have a clue what me was thinking in dirty ways me make sure to be mentioning so sit i outlining the ranks of his colorism well expressed i wrote what it do to african jamaicans blast way him superficial me better than on a want to be white world confident a smart girl me take my stance dignified powerful was i message me take time relaying eloquent missiles on those pages i just kept on firing you need to be checking yourself my brethren is what me tell him you to me is no big thing 
me bombard you with layers of social historical understanding. Keep your dirty house slave colorism. Serious was my reasoning, like dog. My written word shame him. My consciousness land upon him. Take that in your pipe, boy, and smoke it. Is how the letter ended. Years later, a good, good friend come back a yard. She says she see him. The brother take the letter hard. Was not expecting from me a written scolding. Tell me say, him tell her that the letter was belittling. So it should be. Those words denounced Willie Lynch programming in all forms of house slave mentality he was practicing. He can't help wondering how far colorism get him. Bet he never do it again. Years are not passing, you know, no reason for remember the isms and schisms associated with that the brother there. Are he ugly colorism. One thing is for sure, he never expect this pretty darkening for mashing can. Me make sure I teach him. My written words slap him hard. He met mistake with this self-assured girl from the yard. This African Jamaican pretty pretty darkening.